Time now for sports with Casey Conlon. The calendar turn to October means things are really starting to heat up on the prep football field. Just take a look at these game changers for proof. Coming in at number five this week, Butte Central at Frenchtown, and this is what keeping a play alive looks like. Maroons QB Case Holter goes to his right, then back the other way, eventually finds Matt Simpkins down the field for a 25-yard gain. Butte Central would tie it up, but Frenchtown the last laugh with a win. Number four, Glacier Sentinel. Grizz recruit Drew, Drew Turner led the Wolfpack to their first win. How about 200 yards and five touchdowns. But he wasn't the best running back of the night. Stay tuned for that. We hit the six man field for number three. Sunburst against Power Dutton Brady. Refiners QB Lane Learham looking in the corner of the end zone to his favorite 6 4 target, Trayton Pickering. Watch the big man haul in the catch and get the left foot in bounds for the score. Check the replay. He taps the left. Sunburst rolls to the win. We find the upset of the night at number two. Shepard hosting undefeated Cole Strip and Mustangs QB Jake Trotter takes matters into his own hands in a scoreless game. Keeps it on the veer left, up the sidelines, breaks a tackle, and he's going to go 80 yards to the house. 7 0 Mustangs. They end the Colts their first loss. 14 6 the final. All those good, but none better than central running back Ben Voss's night. A game for the ages as the senior needed only 16 carries to rush for 329 yards, believed to be a school record. He scored three times, 19 touchdowns on the season, go along with over 1,100 yards in just six games. Voss submitting his name for Gatorade Player of the Year consideration. He's at least got our vote for number one on this week's list.